two are such sweethearts for helping me out. I'm going to do something special for you. I would never have gotten these home without your help. Ah, I see you're admiring my family. These are my boys, Carl and John. They're all grown up now and have families of their own. They visit me a lot. Oh, <laughs> those are also my babies. Well, not exactly my babies. They're two pigeons from the park. I call the big one Rick and the smaller one Sue. I've watched them grow from chicks to full-grown pigeons. I want you two to have this for carrying my groceries. But I want to do something special for you. I know. Do you like apple crumb cake? <gasps> then I'll bake you one after I do all my chores. I have to feed the pigeons in the park, go to the doctor for a checkup, sweep the floor, clean the dishes, and hang my wet laundry on the line. Isn't that great? She's going to make us an apple crumb cake. I can almost taste it now. It's going to be a while, Samuel. She has lots of chores to do. Well, we're going to help her with those anyway, right? Oh, yeah. With the two of us helping her, Mrs. Lopez will finish them a lot quicker. Now, when the pigeons come, you break off a small piece of bread and throw it to them. Ready? Here you go, my babies. Hey, that was mine. Oh, I got to it first. Why don't you two share that piece? <laughs> that wasn't very nice, Sue. Come on, be nice. Oh, give me that back. It's mine. No fighting. There's enough for everyone. Hey, I'm eating here. No, I got this one. I didn't get any Calm down, my baby. Oh, I don't like it when they get like this, arguing and grabbing. But they are my darlings. I have to run back to my home and get more bread. Oh, got any more bread? No. How about you? You got any? Huh? No, but Mrs. Lopez went back to get you more. Even though all of you acted so badly... We acted badly? You made Mrs. Lopez feel badly. She doesn't like to see you fight. Oh, we don't want to make her feel bad. She's our friend. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you know how to share? We've never tried. If you shared, that would make Mrs. Lopez happy. How do we do it? We want to make Mrs. Lopez happy. I'll pretend I'm a teacher. I might be able to teach you how to work together and share the art of cooperation. There's more than enough bread for all of you to share. All you have to do is line up and wait your turn. That's it? Yes. We can do that. Sure. I got more bread. Please, my darlings, try to get along this time. Oh, my! What good birds! And one for you? Here's a piece for you and you. And that's it. We're done. I'm off to the doctor for my checkup. Will you two wait for me at my home? I promise to bake you an apple crumb cake, and I will. Oh, hey, guys. How we do? Terrific. You waited in line, and everyone got a piece of bread. Cooperation in action. You made Mrs. Lopez very happy. I'm glad. She's very good to us. Maybe we should do something for her. Oh, that's a good idea, but what? Hey, Samuel, if they helped us, we could get Mrs. Lopez's chores done even faster. Good idea, Nina. Do you guys want to help Mrs. Lopez with her chores? Sure. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I'll pretend I'm the leader of a marching band, and you can follow me to Operation Cleanup. We've got dishes to clean, the floor to sweep, and laundry to hang. Ready? Let's get busy. Yes! Hold it. Everyone, please come on over here. We're not doing this right. Rick and Sue, you sweep the dust into the dustpan and put it in the garbage. And look at the laundry. It has to be hung neatly or it won't dry all the way. If two pigeons bring out the clothes and another clipped on clothespins, then you could hang the laundry the right way. If we work together and cooperate, we can get everything done by the time Mrs. Lopez gets home. While they're doing that, Samuel, you and I can clean the dishes. I wash, you dry. Deal! Let's get busy! My laundry is done. The dishes? You did that too? Oh, thank you all very much. Now, I want to do something for all of you. Line up for apple crumb cake. For all my helpers, I cut you a special piece, Samuel. Okay, Bag. If you're real, real careful, I'll share my crayons with you. Okay. There you go. Bag, what's going on? What are you doing to my new crayons? Take them out right now! Oh no! Don't tell me they got all crunched up to nothing. Don't tell me. Very funny. <laughs> Something cool is coming your way Full of ideas and ready to play Let's do something fun today Big Bang You can do it Big Bang Big through it Big Bang Get into it Big Bang Come along, it's time to pretend Make some music, make a friend Loads of laughs from end to end from Children's Television Workshop, the creators of Sesame Street. Brand new to video. A full hour of non-stop surprises. Big Bad. Something cool is coming your way. Full of ideas and ready to play. Let's do something fun today. Big Bad. You can do it. Big Bad. Get into it. Big Bad. All you need to watch and play along is any bag full of ordinary stuff and lots of imagination. So join in the fun with Chelly, Molly, Bag, and all their friends. Uh, this is Bag, my best pal. Each tape features six different fun-filled cartoons, plus two original music videos performed by kids to dance and sing along with. The whole Big Bag gang is waiting for you to explore with us, share with us, imagine with us. Big Bag, it's a ton of fun for everyone. Come on, guys, let's get started. Yay! New on video from PBS for incredible adventure, action, Hi! and fun. Watch Adventures from the Book of Virtues. Cool, I'll go get the book. Hold on to your seat as Zach, Annie, and Plato Bravo! take you on amazing journeys. Long, long time ago in ancient Greece. And the coolest missions. Yeah. yeah. 
It's the ultimate video series with the greatest stories you'll want to watch again and again. See what even a kid can do? The adventure starts here. The adventure of virtues. With adventures from the Book of Virtues. Collect them all.